So now we're in the load section of the tutorial series and um, yeah what we should have is the save right um, oh I'm sorry I'm over here so the save so I go ahead and you know earn a lot of cookies I save and if I look in my database I can see like yes it is saving the number of cookies that I have in the database along with all of my other buildings right but then when it send when the um, the PHP code right here on the header sends me back to cookieclicker.php um, what I wanted to do is I wanted to load all of the data from the database in so that it shows 32 here right after I saved so that's what we're going to be doing now and uh, you could see that happening here right so here I have a million I just have a million cookies I'll go ahead and save it it'll come back here and I have a million okay if I go ahead and log out and then I log in it should load a million cookies right that I just saved in this account I'll submit and you can see here that I have a million okay so that's the kind of behavior that I want to create here and the first step to getting that done is that we need to create a load state function in the JavaScript file and execute it in the start function okay because we want to load this load state function is going to do all of that stuff that we just talked about it's going to get the data from the database insert it into our cookie clicker j JavaScript game um, and then you want to ask yourself like wh how many times do you want it to run do you want it to run like constantly right like do you want it to run um, in the loop the set interval loop then we would put it I inside of update or do you want it to just run once well we just want to load once right when we first like get into the application we don't want it to like load constantly so we would want to do it right here in the start function so that it happens once so I'm going to say load state call it there and then I guess right here we could just like define the function so function load underscore state and yeah we'll go ahead and talk about how to define it in the next couple of videos